In this video, we are going to understand the relationship between the degree of a polynomial function and the number of its graph's turning points. When we look at this graph of the function f of x equals x to the fifth minus 7x cubed plus 9x plus 1, we see that the graph has four turning points. Recall that at each turning point the graph changes direction from increasing to decreasing and vice versa. The function equation has 5 as its greatest exponent, so it's therefore a polynomial function of degree 5. Notice that the graph has 4 turning points, so that's 1 less than 5. In general, we can say if a polynomial function has the degree n, then the graph of that function has at most n minus 1 turning points. So the number of turning points is at most 1 less than the degree of the polynomial function. We see that the y-coordinate of each turning point is either a relative maximum or a relative minimum of f. Without a graphing calculator or the knowledge of calculus, it's difficult and often impossible to locate turning points of polynomial functions with degrees greater than 2. This video is what I did for you. If you want to do something for me, hit the bell button like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching and happy learning everyone.